Hey guys, it's your Nerd Derp, and welcome back to more Super Mario 64. In the last episode, we did Course 5, which was Big Boo's Haunt, which is the last course we can do as of now. Um, what I decided to do is actually go ahead and face Bowser now, because that'll just open up a bunch of stuff that I can do, and then I can get all the caps and everything, so I actually do need to face Bowser now. So let's go through this door. And you can um, go through here any time once you have at least eight stars, but I'm just, I just kind of waited a bit. Oh, it's a pretty picture of Beach. Let's go see her. No, it was a trap. <laughs> of course it was. <laughs> you stepped right into my trap, just as I knew you would. I warned you, friend. Watch your step. Okay, so with that being said, here we are. This is called Bowser in the Dark World. So there are going to be 8 red coins in this one that's going to be in every Bowser stage. But I'm going to go ahead and wait on getting those because I need to do all the secret ones in one go. At least that's how I plan on doing it and I don't want to just get it now and then, I don't know, that's be a pain in the ass. So I'm just going to wait to get those. So I'm just going to kind of just go through the stage. So let's go through here. Go ahead and grab that. That's a nice one up for us. No. Go ahead and wait for that. Oh, I really like the feel of this level. Oh, oh my god, I got shot. <laughs> I was right right there, but it doesn't matter. <laughs> Overall, the set is pretty linear. We just go left to right, and I just died. Fuck! Okay, we are back. Now we know not to be careless. Okay, wait for that to go, and there we go. Don't get coins right there, but it doesn't really matter. The coins are pretty obvious, to be perfectly honest. They're not, like, hidden or anything. The only one they're really hidden on is uh, the last one. The last Bowser stage, I should say. But otherwise, it's pretty easy. And since we're not going for that, we can just complete the stage as normal. Let's head on up here. We'll go and do shoulder jump. Go through here, and yeah, we're pretty much right at the end, too. Be kind of careful right here, though. I tend to die here a lot. So you just have to kind of aim just right. I'm gonna do it backwards, we'll say. Go on and go up these stairs. Whoa, what the hell was that? <laughs> no, go, okay. And if you do the eight red coins ones uh, now, the star will disappear right here. But it won't take you out of the stage, so don't worry about that. Let's go on and head to the pipe. Tough luck, Mario! Princess Toadstool isn't here! Wahaha! Go ahead, just try and grab me by the tail! You'll never be able to swing me around! It looks like you won't throw me out of here! Never! Wow, you suck at being a bad guy because you told me exactly how I'm supposed to beat you. So I'm supposed to grab you by the tail. Oh, I'm gonna get hit by a thing, of course. And you just wanna spin the control stick around. Spin me like a baby. Not like a record baby, that one. Go ahead and just keep spinning it and wait till you see a bomb and then just hit it. Or B. I think it's B? Yeah, I think it's B. No. No. There we go. Let's go ahead and swing this dude. Oh, it is B. Oh, yeah, for some reason that was A. You can just, um, get him close to it and then just do it that way, just kind of like that. You don't have to actually throw him really hard, so it's pretty easy. I was a bit careless. This is not as I had planned, but I still have the power of the stars, and I still have Peach. Bwahaha, you'll get no more stars from me. I'm not finished with you yet, but I'll let you go for now. You'll pay for this later. That's a weird teleportation mode. But let's go on and grab a key. It isn't a star per se, but it is a key nonetheless. I think it does count for a star, though. I'm not totally sure on that, actually. I wasn't paying attention. But that's that one, and now that we um, have defeated Bowser, the almighty Bowser person, um, I'm gonna go ahead and just do the caps in this video, because, I mean, might as well just do it on one video, right? So, the first cap. The first cap is the wing cap, and we see the sunlight right here? Let's go and look up on that. If we do, we're gonna be teleported. If I can turn the right way. 
And they actually do make a throwback to this in, um, Tomorrow Sunshine. Welcome to the Wing Cap Core. Step on the red switch at the top of the tower in the center of the rainbow ring. When you trade the switch, all the red blocks you'll find will be just solid. Try out the Wing Cap. Do a triple jump to take off and press C to land. Pull back on the control stick to go up and push forward to nosedive, just as you would when flying a plane. Now, there are red coins in this one as well, but like I said, I'm not doing the red coin missions right now. I'm just trying to unlock everything, and then I'll do the red coin stuff later. Go and just pound that switch. And now, all of them are back to normal. So, let's go ahead and save. And let's dive on down. Don't worry, it doesn't count as you dying or anything, so don't worry about that. Okay, so now we have that one. Now, what we're gonna do is go get the, um... We're gonna get the invisible cap one. So, to get that one, we're gonna go through this door and head on down here. And this is where the second part of the game is. It's the basement. Let's go unlock that door. And here is a, another door. Let's go ahead and see how many we need. Yeah, we have to have at least 30 stars in order to unlock that door, but we're not going to do that till way later, so we're not going to worry about that for now. But what we want to do, actually, is head on over here. Oh, there's a rabbit! There's a rabbit! But we'll get him later. We'll go through this door, actually. And now we're going to see some water, so let's go on and go for a dive. Okay, so once you do that, go ahead and read this sign, it'll give us a little hint. It is decreed that one shall pound the pillars. So basically, that's literally all we do is pound the pillars. It needs to be particular, and I got stuck on the camera. That's not fun. You. Come here. No. Jump. Dude, what is going on here? There, was that so hard? Oh. And there we go. So, and that's gonna drain all the water. Remember this area earlier where it was, you know, filled with water? But that's where the uh, next cap is, actually. It's gonna be right in this hole over here. In Super Mario 64 DS, though, you're gonna need Wario, so you have to unlock him. But for now, we can just go. And here's the invisible cap. Welcome to the Vanish Cap Switch Course. All the blue blocks you find will become solid once you step on the cap switch. They'll disappear when you put on the Vanish Cap so you'll be able to elude enemies and walk through many things. Try it out. And like I said before, there are red coins in here, but we're not doing that now, so... But you still take fall damage, even if you are invisible, per se. But we won't get hurt by that fire or anything. There's not one there because we're still... We haven't unlocked it, per se. Raise that up. Raise me up. I heard that from somewhere. I think... Who sung that? I think I heard, um, Only Boys Allowed sing that? Like, Raise Me Up or whatever? That's a good song. Okay, let's go and raise that up. Jump on this, and we do need to be careful here, especially at the top, because those will go like that. But, no! No, no, no! Aw, that makes me sad. Okay, and we're back, so we're gonna jump down here, and then jump down here. There we go, that's how we're supposed to do it. And then wait till we get right here, jump to that one. Alrighty, oh, oh god, no, 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 oh god, no, no, <laughs> that was such bullshit. <laughs> no! Come on, come on, come on, we got this, we got this, we got this, there's no way we don't got this, okay. Go and pound that. And now all the uh, blue ones will be all activated and everything. And then, um, to get the, um, the, the red coin star and everything, you would just go through here. But we don't have it, so we can just drop on down. Okay, and now we're gonna go ahead and get the last cap, which is the metal cap. Now that's going to be in a stage we haven't even started yet, but I'm just going to show you how to get it. Then we're going to start that course in the uh, next episode. So, this is a little heads up. So Now the, um, the course itself is called Hazy Maze. The Hazy Maze Cave. 
something. It's something like that. I, I don't know the exact name. But uh, we're going to go and head there. So what we want to do is go on and head to the basement. Okay, I went ahead and just cut to me to get into the basement because it was kind of a waste of time. And, you know, I figured it's faster. <laughs> okay, uh, but the store you want to go in, it's kind of hard to tell. But it's um the one without any stars on it, which is this one up here. It's, it's kind of weird you don't need any stars again in this one, but I guess it doesn't really matter. So, yeah, whatever. Anyway, go on and jump through this. Okay, so what we want to do for the metal cap, which is, that's what it looks like, by the way, it's kind of like a green box. Um, you actually want to head this way. This is the way to where you want to go. You can go and just do a launch up right there. But if you don't make it, you're kind of SOL, so to speak. So what we want to do is jump. Oh, jump over here. Try to make that. No, 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 no. Don't die. You can die right there, so be careful. Launch up right here and avoid the boulders. That's definitely a good thing. <laughs> Uh, let's go over here, and go through this door right here, and then all we want to do is uh, just go down on the elevator. Oh my god, no, my butt. <laughs> That's not good. But we are in the uh, right area, so what we want to do is just head on down here. This is actually where the first star is, but we're not even doing that. <laughs> Okay, I am actually thinking of something else. Now, what we want to do is find this beast over here. The swimming beast, so to speak. Let's go ahead and find him. And then basically how he works is you stay on him until you get to where you want to go. Then just ground pound on him and then he'll do... What, what was he doing? Why is he spinning in a circle? Well, I, I gotta stop you from doing that. So, let's do that. I'm actually gonna get on his head. There we go. That's what I need to do. Oh, this camera angle. Okay. Why is he spinning in circles? What is he doing? Okay, so let's wait for him to go over here. And it's that door over there that we want to go to. So let's wait for him to go there. Go. Yeah, jump off. No, I missed. Far. <laughs> What the fuck? I swear under him. There we go. I finally did it. I didn't think I was ever going to do it. So we want to go through this door. Head on over here. And jump in the thing again. And now we are Metal Cap Mario. Welcome to the Metal Cap Splice Chorus. Once you stop the cast, all the green blocks will become solid. When you turn your body into metal, <clears throat> with the Metal Cap, you can walk underwater. Try it. And that's actually pretty useful. You can also just walk into enemies and then they die instantly, so you don't have to worry about getting hit or anything like that. So it turns you invisible. And you can also just walk through currents and it's you know, pretty nice. So we definitely want to be able to abuse that. But that switch is our main focus. We want to go ahead and take that. Oh no. No, 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 no. Okay. Don't want to go out there yet. Because we're not even done. Okay, so now I actually have to be careful and not get hit like I just did. <clears throat> and yeah, so let's go over here. Jump up here. And that is the uh, last one. The metal caps will pop out of the green blocks you find. I would like to say for sure. <laughs> and um, since we didn't get the right coins yet, I'm going to do that very soon. But we're not doing that now. Let's go in and just head on out. I'd say this was a very productive episode, so to speak. Um, we beat Bowser, and we got all the caps. Whoa. <laughs> He's like flew out of a freaking waterfall. That's crazy. But we beat Bowser, we got all the caps, and uh, yeah. Um, next time, we are actually going to um, do all of the, um, all the stars in the first world, or first part of the world, I should say, that um, we couldn't do because we had the lack of stars, or caps, I should say. And then after that, we're going to go ahead and start the basement levels. So, yeah, we're going to go ahead and do that. So, next time we'll do just that. Uh, be sure to leave a like down below if you enjoyed this video. Be sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already for more Super Mario 64 and other awesome videos. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time on Super Mario 64. Herp, herp.